It's great to have Anthony Albanese in Western Australia once again, as he said, for the 20th time in under two years. Uh, the, the Albanese government gets Western Australia. They understand the important role that we will play in the energy transformation of Australia and the important role that Western Australia will play in the renewable energy future as a renewable energy exporter, a significant player in the critical minerals market and how we continue to diversify our economy to continue to sustain great Western Australian jobs. The announcement today that he made as part of his vision of continuing to diversify and progress manufacturing in Australia is two really important commitments. One, $33.5 million towards our transformative Westport project, which will see uh, the Quinana Industrial District uh, transformed and become a key export uh, piece of economic infrastructure. And indeed, he also outlined his vision to, for Geoscience Australia to continue to map the critical uh, deposits that we have of all the resources which, of course, underpin our prosperity. It will complement the work that we are doing with the WA Array project and will continue to consolidate Western Australia's position, not only as a resource and um, oil, uh, oil and gas uh, supplier to the rest of the nation and, indeed, our trading partners in Southeast Asia, but also continuing to support our critical minerals industry and our move up the value chain for battery manufacture. Western Australia is on the cusp of an exciting economic future and we need to have a government in Canberra that understands our vision and complements it with great policies. Uh, the Albanese government is doing everything it can to, to complement our vision for Western Australia to become a, a resources powerhouse, but also to become a renewable energy exporter and, of course, an important partner of the global supply chain for critical minerals and battery energy manufacture. Also underpinning a lot of this stuff is understanding that people in the community need support, particularly around housing, particularly around those who are doing it tough with the cost of living. And it's great to see uh, uh, the Prime Minister outline some of those policies which will obviously continue to be an important part of what we're doing, keeping the Western Australian economy strong and helping those who are doing it tough.